Hey everyone, welcome back to another video. Sarah here from The Comic Den. Angelo is getting ready, then he will hop in to the video with us. But today we have a few things we need to do. We need to do some organizing, and we have some stuff that's sold that we need to go ahead and package up. And then I think we are going to go to the comic shop if it's open. Today is Labor Day, so we need to call them and see if they're open because we need a few more bags and boards. So we're gonna just take you guys along with us and show you how the day is gonna go. Thanks for watching. All right, so I'm gonna put all these things that aren't bagged and board in this little side over here. So then when we do get bagged and boards later, I can actually bag and board them. And then this one's signed, so we'll put that to the side. I'm trying to get all our signed stuff together. A lot of them don't have any COAs, so we're thinking about sending them to CBCS. All right guys, Angelo here. We got a pretty busy day today. Sold a lot of stuff on eBay yesterday. Thank you to everybody, all the new subscribers, all the new followers, welcome. Check out the giveaway going on on the Instagram right now. We're super close to 500. Welcome everybody, like I said. And hope you guys enjoy the video. Drop a comment, drop a like, and enjoy. So as you guys can see, we sold nine things. Paid, shipped, thank you. Love when you guys pay right away. Love when you guys pay in a week, it don't matter as long as you pay, <laughs> all right? All right guys, so let me just show you really quickly kind of what we sold. So I had one customer purchase these pretty cool set, connecting covers. Spider-Man X-Men 100th anniversary number one variant. So those were purchased yesterday. This is a cool little Sentry lot. Sentry and Hulk, and I also got Century and X-Men, Century and Fantastic Four, and then the fourth one, Century and Spider-Man. Batman, White Knight, Men in Black issue one, super clean copy. And I also, also purchased a Nova run I was selling, Nova one through five. So that's what we sold, we're gonna package them up. We'll show you what it looks like when we're all done. All right, guys, so here is kind of what everything looks like once it's all pre-packaged, and then I'll show you kind of what the last little step looks like. All right, guys, so we are back, and this is kind of what separates me from the crowd, I think. Most people would just call it quits right here. You know, I have everything packaged up in the envelopes with the bubble wrap, the mailers, and then we got the business cards with the cardboard inside, but we're gonna show you the last step here. All right, everybody, so we're back, and as you can see, we have everything packaged up in its own little separate boxes here for the proper weights. Um, I try to tell people all the time, make sure you have the proper packages, because as you can see, I have three different ways of shipping things just right here alone. All right, guys, so we just got done wrapping everything up, and as you can see, it definitely benefits you to have, you know, different packing materials. But this is pretty much how everything gets packaged up. Um, as you can see, Sarah's been organizing some stuff today. I've been packaging stuff up. We're going to run over to the comic shop in a little bit and grab some more bags and boards because we do have a lot of stuff that needs to be bagged and boarded. And I hope you guys are enjoying the video so far. If you have any questions, you know, leave them in the comments below, and hope you're all having a great day. All right, stay tuned. All right, guys, so as you can see, this is what the final product looks like from this week's sales, well, this weekend sales. Thank you to everybody, and let's get on with the day. Hey, guys, so we're going to show you some of the comic books that we found in the new collection, and Angelo's going to tell you a little bit about them. Yeah, so guys. This is the first one. Here's a really cool Ultimate X-Men Wizard one half. You can turn that around. I think there's a, uh, yeah, there you go. Cool little COA that comes with it, so that's a limited. Now that's a really cool Batman with a black mask, 636. Do you know what that is? I'll give you guys a couple seconds to answer. First appearance of Bloodsport. Yep, which was the character that Idris Elba played. In Suicide Squad, really nice, astonishing X-Men number three copy. I'm thinking of getting that one CGC'd along with... Astonishing X-Men number six. number six, first Abigail brand, I believe. This right here is the first Marvel Zombies, Fantastic Four, number 21, Ultimate Fantastic Four. These are some of those cooler limited 
you guys can see based off of, I'll show you the back right here, they have these dynamic forces, COAs, and some of them, like this one, you can see the cover is, has really nothing on it. And there's this one. And then this one with the gold foil, you can see, and then you have this one. They're both dynamic forces, just different covers, so those are pretty cool. This is another one of those dynamic forces foil, New Avengers. Number, what is that, 35 with a Venom Wolverine cover. Really nice cover on that book. San Diego Comic Unfortunately, it's not the first appearance of Hellboy, but still a nice copy. San Diego Comic Con Comics 1992. Yeah, you get all those cool characters on the cover. This is another one of those um, wizard exclusives with, they are signed. Should say on the back, who's it signed by? I should say. Dan Jurgens and Michael Lopez. There you go, so signed by Dan Jurgens, Michael Lopez. This was a cool one that I found that I wasn't aware of. Yeah, it's actually worth a couple bucks too. This is Jim Henson's Muppet Babies, number one. Pretty decent copy. This is a book that you wouldn't really think is worth anything, and it's really not, but if you can pick it up really quick and show that barcode. This is not a direct, but I'll show it right here. The barcode, as you can see, it is not a direct edition. So that's just a cool little book I found. This is the final issue of Power Man and Iron Fist, number 125. I believe it's also the death of Iron Fist. Could be wrong about that. Mm -hmm. Cool little book. Ninja Turtles. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Teach Karate, issue number one. That's a clean book right there, volume one. This is a cool book. I have a bunch of these. Yeah, this one is signed, as you can see. Let me see the book and I'll show them really quickly. So this is the first appearance of Gen 13. I have about 10 copies of that. This was another one too. Yeah, this is like a magazine style book. The Marvel Swimsuit Special made for Madripoor. Or Mad for Madripoor. That's a nice little expensive, kind of expensive book. This is a nice little key. We got Civil War, The Amazing Spider-Man 529, First Iron Spider. This is the second appearance of Deadpool, X-Force number two. This is a book I never understood why it wasn't worth more money. These are cool little variants. Ghost Panther number one. Hot little character. Yeah, this is the black and white cover. We got some Ghost Rider variants over here. So that's a cool one. That's the regular cover, and then this is the black and white, so that's a cool one. And then this is the final book we thought we would show you guys in today's video. It's the cool little Blade One. So, hope you guys enjoyed. Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching, guys. All right, guys. guys, we are done organizing and shipping stuff out for now. So we're gonna go ahead and head over to the comic shop and give them a call. They are open, so that's cool. So we're gonna head over there. We need some more boards Probably for the like current what, books. Three, four hundred of them. Yeah, like three, four hundred. We got a lot of raw books that were in this collection. Yeah. Um, so you know, want to keep them in good condition. So we wanna bag and board them. Sorry for the shakiness. We live on a dirt road, so yeah. <laughs> it's a little crazy. But we'll catch you guys at the comic shop. All right, everybody, we just left the comic shop, so we got what we needed, and that's pretty much it for today. We're just gonna go home, bag and board some stuff, and then we're just gonna relax and enjoy the rest of our Labor Day. Yeah, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Hope Thank it was you so much for watching. Make sure you like, leave any comments, questions you guys have, and we will see you next video. Bye.